Good morning students, how are you all? So today we are going to study about light fractions and unlight fractions. Let's study the definition first. Light fractions, fractions with the same denominators are light factor, light fractions, okay? Here I have taken some example like 2 by 7, 5 by 7, 6 by 7. Here all the denominators are equal, that is 7. So these fractions are light fractions. In the same way, for the unlike fractions, the fractions with different denominators are unlike fractions. For example, you can take many examples for that. I have taken 3 by 5, 3 by 7, 4 by 9. Here, denominators are all different. 5, 7, 9. So, denominators are different, so they are unlike fractions. Now, if you are asked how you can make two unlike fractions are like fractions, then there are some steps. Let's follow them and convert this 2 by 3, 7 by 4 into a like fractions. So first is, first step is find the LCM of the denominator. So here 3 and 4 are having, uh, 3 and 4 we are having as the denominator. So let's take out the LCM of 3 and 4. So it will be what? 12. Okay. The LCM of 3 and 4 will be 12. Now, Second step is, write the denominator equal to LCM to get the equivalent fractions. Okay? We uh, know that what are equivalent fractions? We have to equate them. So, first of all, if I am talking about 2 by 3. So, if I am taking the LCM as 12. So, with which number we will multiply 3 in order to get 12? Yes, by 4. Okay? And to make it an equivalent fraction, the number which, are divide, which we are multiplying in the denominator, in the same way we will multiply in the numerator also. So into 4, so 2 into 4 will give you what? 8 and 3 4 is 12. So the equivalent fraction will be 8 by 12. In the same way for 7 by 4, okay, you, your calcium is 12. So what you will multiply with 4 in order to get 12? Yes, 3. So 4 3's are 12 and in the same way you will multiply the same number in numerator also in order to get the equivalent fraction. So 4 3's are 12, 7 3's are 21. So now 8 by 12 and 21 by 12 are converted from unlike fractions to like fractions. Now looking at them we can tell which one is the smaller one. Yes, the numerator is smaller, so 8 by 12 is smaller than 21 by 12. Okay, now there is another method also how you can find out that the given two fractions are uh, between which fraction is greater and the, which one is smaller. So, let's take it the alternate method in that what we have to do, we just have to cross multiply them. Okay? Means we will cross multiply this 4 by 2, 4 by 2 and we will multiply this 3 by 7. So what you will get? Here you will get 8 is equal to, we will get 27. So this product is smaller. So yes, then the number 2 by 3 is smaller than 7 by 4. Okay? 2 by 3 is smaller than 7 by 4. Understood? Now let's move on to some more. Now, addition and subtraction of unlike fractions. So here I have written the steps and here we are going to do according to step. We will solve this one. Okay. First is Find the LCM of the denominator of the given fraction. So here we are given 5 by 6 plus 4 by 9. We have to take the LCM of 6 and 9. So what will be the LCM of 6 and 9? It will be 8. Okay. Now convert the given fraction into like fractions with the common denominator. So for that what we were doing? Okay. 5 by 6 is equal to 8. What we will multiply with 6 in order to get 80? With 3 and in the same number we will multiply the numerator also. So 15 upon 80. Okay. In the same way 4 by 9 is equal to upon 80. 
So, 4 by 9, 9 will be multiplied with 2 in order to get 18 and the same way, 2 will be multiplied in the denominator and numerator both. So, 4 into 2 is 8. So, we will get, we get 2 equivalent fractions that are 15 by 18 and 8 by 18. So, let's add them. Okay. 15 by 18 plus what we got? 15 by 18 plus 8 by 18. Okay. 8 by 18. So, the denominator is common. So, 15 plus 8 will give you what? Yes, it will give you 23. So, you got the answer 23 by 18. Now, in the same way, we will do the subtraction.